Bryant's death hit a small north central Washington community particularly hard. Bryant was in Kashmir just two weeks ago with his daughter, making good on a promise to catch a high school girls basketball game featuring one of the nation's top college recruits. Now, she plays for Kashmir High School. That's between Leavenworth and Wenatchee in Chelan County. And Kara Sevens, Deborah Horn is live at Rainier Beach Community Center in Seattle. And Deborah, the player Bryant was there to see attended his basketball camp. In fact, Monique Haley Van Litz spent most of last summer at Bryant's basketball camp, practicing her basketball moves, a lot like these kids here in Rainier Beach. We're told she also spent a lot of time at his home. Well, now we had a chance to talk to the man who planned Bryant's cashmere visit. It is still almost impossible for Jeff Carlson to believe. Yeah, unreal, just the chain of events and what occurred and how we're Kashmir, a small town community in north central Washington is connected to this huge national story. We met Carlson, Kashmir School's athletic director, at the Renton Pavilion, there for the Washington Interscholastic Activities Association's winter meeting. He and Kobe Bryant's assistant worked for a week planning the legendary player's visit. The big day came two Saturdays ago. He walked around the car and acted like he knew me. He said, how you doing, Jeff? And it was uh, pretty special. Got to shake his hand. And... You can see in this video that Bryant had brought along his personal bodyguard and his 13-year-old daughter, Gigi, a standout basketball player in her own right. They sat beside the parents of Haley Van Lith, the Kashmir superstar they had come to see. What was really special is after the game, you know, as soon as the buzzer went off, we were able to get Kobe and Gigi and uh, Junior into the locker room to spend time with our team. And man, Kobe uh, signed autographs. He took pictures individually with each of the girls. It was a really special time and uh, just made the news that we got yesterday uh, um, just that much more heartbreaking. Especially with the deaths of both Bryant and his young daughter. To feel connected in some way with him, it was just, uh, it was a hard, hard pill to swallow for sure. In fact, he says they are planning to honor Kobe Bryant tomorrow night at the Kashmir High School girls basketball home game. We'll let you know how it goes. Reporting live at Rainier Beach here in Seattle, Deborah Horn, Carol 7 News. Thousands of people have shared tributes to Kobe Bryant on social media. You can share our story right now from the Cairo 7 News app to your own Facebook page and Twitter.